welcome to the testing world so now I'll show you what all the common files we are having in BDD framework but before moving to that I want to explain you few things over here first if I talk about you want to automate web based application so automation is a concept in the same way I would say BDD is a concept so I would say automation or BDD is a concept which we need to implement then if we talk about I would say if you want to automate web based application which library or API you want to use you are saying selenium in the same way if you want to implement BDD concept which library you are going to use so we have a different set of libraries uh, like behave jbehave but we are going to use a library one of the most popular library which is cucumber so we are going to use cucumber to implement BDD framework then I say okay if you want to implement if you want to use selenium which programming language language you are going to use so you would say okay I'm going to use Java in the same way when we are going to write test cases in cucumber which is in the English kind of language test cases so what will be the language in your case so that will be Gherkin so first we need to understand these three things automation or BDD is a concept to implement automation you can use different API like selenium to implement BDD we can use different API here we are going to use cucumber to write code in selenium we are going to use Java to write code in cucumber we are going to use an English kind of language we call it Gherkin now I'm going to explain you BDD framework and then we'll we will cover Gherkin language here we are using cucumber and the language would be Gherkin so first file that we are we are going to have in the BDD framework is a feature file in previous session we have seen first of all a stakeholder or end user or business user will write test cases in English kind of language and that language is Gherkin so where he is going to write test cases or I'll say end-to-end -end scenario so we need to create a feature file in this feature file we are going to have end-to-end -end scenario we also call it behavior of the application that is written by business user or stakeholder and it will be in a simple English kind of language we call it Gherkin so that is the first file we are going to write when we are going to implement BDD framework and if you check it here that's a sample file I have given here so if you notice we are writing test cases or I'll say end-to-end -end scenarios in simple English language so that's the first file we are going to create in BDD framework the next file would be step definition file okay what is step definition file if you talk about the feature file that we have created in which we have written test cases in Gherkin language that's simply English kind of language but to execute these test cases we need automation code so here we are going to write a step definition file in which we will have actual automation code that will be written in any programming language like Java Python or any other which you are using and this file is written by the automation tester that is the automation tester task so that would be second file we are going to write third would be runner file so runner you can take it as to trigger execution if you talk about Java when we are writing code in Java and we want to execute we need main method if you talk about JUnit or testng we need annotations in the same way when you want to execute your BDD framework we need a file we call it runner file with the help of which we can trigger execution and after doing some settings we can generate report so that's a sample runner file now I'm moving to the next image and that's very important here we can make a link so if you can see this image here on the left hand side there is a sample feature file for each step written in the sample in this feature file like one step is user is on the login page so to bring user is on the login page we have to write automation code so if you can check it 
here we have written a step definition file which have a method for each step so to bring users on the login page we have a method there we have written the automation code so we will have to write code in this way first we have to write feature file and to automate that task we have to write step definition file which will have actual automation code at the end we would have a runner file so that's my runner file which is going to execute this complete framework last we can check it here we are going to have feature file in which we are going to write test cases in a single English kind of language that is Gherkin and we are going to use some keywords so here these are the keywords given when then I'll show you later then we have actual automation code in the test case file we also call it step definition file there we can write code by using selenium or any other API with different programming language so we are going to use selenium with Java then we have a test runner which is going to execute your test case and also going to generate report so that is our common files which we are going to create in the BDD framework in next session onwards I'll I'll help you to write feature file by using Gherkin language that's all we have for this session thanks for watching this video